to really enter this, this big silence is, is, to, is to leave the world as we, as we know it, you see. It's like suddenly, to a certain degree, there is nothing, nothing, nothing. The, the, as soon as I, I tap into this, this silence, there is no shy, there is no story, there is no someone that gives satsang or does this or do, does that and, and the future of this person and that the, there is, it's because it's so timeless, it's so untouched that everything is wiped away. And again, it takes time then to, to say, okay, okay, the, the, uh, the, they can live together. Yeah, if, if the whole universe can live together with silence, then probably, probably this works. And, and if everything can live with nothing, which is already the case, then probably it works. But in, your, in terms of the mind, it is wiped away. In terms of the mind, it is gone, okay? And that's something th that we can understand why there is a, an obvious resistance, because we are clinging, it's, it's our identity, it's what we recognize as ourselves. It's even those thoughts and emotions that, that cause us suffering are at least familiar, you see? And, the, and our ego tells us, they think it tells us, you're going to die. This is horrible, this is nothing, this is black hole. What are you doing? You see? And you're not going to die. It's just the thought that, 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 that was never really real. It's life, it's the life, but, but thinking cannot imagine that. Just like, you know, thinking thinks of uh, death as, some, as a sort of its own, ver its own end and it cannot imagine anything beyond it. But beyond death, there is eternal life. So that's one thing. When there is timelessness, the whole story is gone. Past, future, present, all gone. There is just being. The second is, is habit, it's momentum. We have given for maybe 20, 30, I don't know how old you are, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, <laughs> uh, no, uh, years. constant attention, you, you have been feeding this identity, this thinking for so many years, every day. Now it's like a machine that is self-generating, you see? You cannot, it's, how can you stop it? It's like it's going, it has so much power. That then when you say, hey, hey, I actually don't want that. I am going the other direction. It, it, who cares? Because it's, it's already at work. And, it's, and you need to give as much energy to the other thing in order to, to, to be able to shift your, your whole being. But the thing is that freedom, you don't need to wait until you shift all your energy. Because the mind is already free. It's just noticing it. It's
a single moment of, of just looking beneath, behind, through. And this entire machine, with all its sophistication, is revealed as you know, it's just nothing, it's, it's thin air. And it happens, it's very easy. It's actually perhaps, again, the problem is that it's too easy. It's just too easy.